Hey everybody and welcome to Animal Planet Videos. In this video, we will discover the top 10 albino animals you have never seen. Make sure to watch until number one because it's one of the rarest ones. Let's get right into it. Number 10, albino tiger. The tiger is one of the most deadly predators in the wild. However, this particular tiger is missing the pigment in its fur, making it white. The white or albino tiger has had a special place of reverence in the Orient. There are legends that say that during times of peace they will appear, and during times of war they will come to vanquish enemies, and they will only leave until all fighting ceases. While not very common, there have been some sightings reported throughout history on this particular breed of tiger. One was described as having gold stripes by sailors on the Black Sea coasts. Another one was seen in Turkestan around 1820, before disappearing after 30 minutes, and yet another one was described as lurking along the borders of Nepal, Tibet. More recently, in the early parts of the 20th century, a Swedish naturalist reported seeing a white one among the pride of some ordinary striped tigers. The strange thing about these sightings was that none of the witnesses mistook the albino tigers for polar bears, which were known to be white at the time. Number 9. Albino Zebra Zebras are one of the most beautiful animals in the wild. However, this zebra is completely white with red eyes. Despite the lack of black and dark brown stripes, it is still a zebra. Although pale white zebras are common in many parts of Africa, this particular animal has an albino coloration with pink skin. Albinism affects the entire animal and sometimes results in blindness or deafness as well. Although it has been reported that some particular albino zebras seem to have no problems with their vision and hearing abilities. The albino zebra was first spotted by safari guys guides and reported to the wildlife authorities. The rare white zebra is suspected of being a part of a group of zebras that escaped from their previous home. The herd has been spotted in Manipools National Park, which is located north of Lake Kariba. The zebra has been transferred to an undisclosed location until it is deemed safe. There are only about 400 albino zebras in the world, and about 100 of those are in Africa. Number 8. Albino Hippopotamus Hippos are one of the most dangerous animals in Africa, with huge, thick bodies and a mouthful of razor-sharp teeth. You do not want to get anywhere near one. This albino hippo does not have any pigment in its fur, making it appear very white. Combined with its red eyes, this made for an unforgettable sight. His natural color pigment allows animals to survive. It provides camouflage and protection from the sun's ultraviolet rays. Without melanin, it is likely that it does have the protection necessary to survive, but with its inability to camouflage, it is extremely susceptible to being hunted. There are no reports claiming that these animals die young or suffer in some other way due to albinism. It appears that its difference from other hippos is more of an inconvenience than anything else. This animal was seen by a group of tourists. They claim that the albino hippo was not an easy sight to see, as it had blended in very well with its surroundings. Number 7. Albino Raccoon an albino raccoon is a rare color variant of the common raccoon. Their most notable characteristics is the total absence of pigment in their fur, eyes, and skin, giving them an almost ghost-like appearance. Raccoons are native to North America, but it is also known as an introduced species in Europe, especially Germany. They are different from regular raccoons because they have a white or light gray color instead of the usual black and brown. Unlike common raccoons, albino raccoons are usually nocturnal. This is because their eyes cannot adjust to too much light, so they prefer for the dark. They are usually not afraid of humans, and they tend to be tamer than common raccoons. They can also stand on their hind legs, just like regular raccoons. Their lifespan is approximately 8 to 15 years, but some have been known to live up to 20 years. Albino animals require special care because they can't blend into their surroundings like regular animals. A number of albino animals can be found in zoos or wildlife parks where they receive special care and protection from the sun. So if you ever get a chance to see an albino raccoon, make sure to take a picture because it's really rare. Number 6. Albino Hedgehog Albino hedgehogs are very rare, but true. One of those was found in Great Britain at the beginning of 2012 and is currently living in an animal rescue center after being taken care of by the woman who found him. He's not alone there either. There are a few other albino hedgehogs living in the same animal rescue too. This amazing creature was found by a 70-year-old woman. She found him in the garden of her flat complex, intriguingly close to a garbage can containing chicken bones. She had been feeding the hedgehog for the past six months and planned to release him back into his natural habitat. 
when he was better. However, after finding out that this small albino creature could be in danger from predators like birds or foxes, she decided that it would be best if she kept him at her flat, but she wasn't planning on keeping him forever. She also stated that she could tell that something was wrong with the hedgehog when she found it. It had very spiky quills, which is abnormal for a hedgehog. However, after finding out that this hedgehog was an albino, she understood why its quills were so spiky. Number 5. Albino Kangaroo The albino kangaroo was seen in an Australian national park. The animal apparently has pink eyes and is possibly blind, making them especially vulnerable to predators. The albino kangaroo is now an endangered species, which means there are very few of them left. Only 1 in 10,000 kangaroos are born albino, according to Australia's National Park Rescue Unit. The albino kangaroo is a marsupial, just like other roos. It carries its young in a pouch and feeds it milk. The kangaroo has big, strong hind legs. These are so powerful, they can leap 20 feet in a single bound. The last one seen by someone was in 2001. A boy named Max found one by a creek in Brulu Park. The kangaroo was about 50 meters away from him, and it hopped away when he saw him. Number 4. Albino Western Gorilla Snowflake was a rare albino gorilla and the only albino gorilla ever seen. He lived at the Barcelona Zoo in Spain. His eyes were pink, his skin was white, and he had red hair on his head. Snowflake was also very smart. He learned how to use sign language, and he also learned how to speak some Spanish. The only problem is that Snowflake couldn't go outside in the sun because his skin was too sensitive. That's why he stayed inside the Barcelona Zoo all the time. He was very popular and many people came to see him. Snowflake died in 2003 at the age of 30. So far, no other albino gorillas have been seen in the wild, and they are considered very rare. Number 3. Albino King Penguin Albino king penguins are a breed of white penguins, considered extremely rare. Most penguins live in cold climates such as Antarctica, not this king penguin. Instead, his snowy white color makes him look like he belongs in the North Pole. The albino king penguin is a mutation in the species Pygosilus papua. The only place they can be found is on Northwest Point on Sydney Island in the South Orkneys. His black eyes are hard to miss in the middle of his white head, making him look even more unique. However, this penguin's unique feature is not just his color. The size of an albino king penguin is around 86 to 92 centimeters long. Their weight is approximately 14 kilograms on average. They mainly eat fish, but will also consume squid, octopus, and krill, but only in the summer. And because of their lack of melamine, they have no protection from the sun. They can easily suffer from sunburn and skin cancer, and their life expectancy is also lower than other penguins because of this. Number 2. Albino Snapping Turtle the albino turtle is extremely rare because of its complete lack of melanin that allows it to blend into its surroundings. The albino turtle is almost completely invisible in the water where they spend most of their lives. They need to be provided with a permanent source of water, such as an aquarium or kiddie pool. Their body length ranges between 14 and 23 inches long. They can weigh between 25 to 50 pounds. These turtles are known for their strong jaws and are capable of creating a vacuum, powerful enough to crush crush the shells of other turtles. The lifespan of these turtles is 30 to 40 years. Snapping turtles are native to the southern region of the United States, specifically to Florida and Louisiana. Their shell is also very sensitive to sunlight, so they tend to hide in the darkness as much as possible. These turtles are also known for their aggressive behavior that can be triggered by the touch of their shells. This behavior is very common for all snapping turtles. Number 1. Albino Alligator the albino alligator is one of the rarest creatures in the world, and if you ever come across one, you'll know it. They look like ghosts, pure white all over their body, with pink eyes and very sharp claws. They are completely blind, but that doesn't stop them from being able to run through the water extremely fast. They can even attack prey just by sensing vibrations in the water. It is estimated that only one in every 100,000 reptiles has the genetic disorder that makes them albino. The albino alligator has pale pink eyes, no pigment on its skin, and along with its limited diet, this makes it one of the most endangered species in America. They can live in fresh water or salt water because they have a special gland that filters the salt out of their body. The albino alligator is thought to be extinct as well as a genetic mutation because it has been many years since people have reported seeing one of them alive. However, you can see an albino alligator in the theme park Gatorland, ubicated in Orlando, Florida.
Which albino animal did you like the most? Let us know in the comments section below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn the notification on so you won't miss any upcoming videos. See you next time!